Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to form a partial differential equation by eliminating the arbitrary function. In the given question, the number of arbitrary function present are 2. Those are the function f and g. Let's take this as the first expression. And to eliminate the arbitrary functions, we are going to use dou z by dou x, which is p, then dou z by dou y, which is q, then dou square x z by dou x square, which is r, then dou square z by dou x dou y, which is s, then dou square z by dou y square, which is t. So we are going to use all this to eliminate the arbitrary functions. Let's take the first expression and we are going to differentiate this first expression partially with respect to x. Now this becomes dou z by dou x equal to f derivative is f dash of 2x plus y into 2 then g derivative is g dash of 3x minus y into 3. This is our second expression. Then again taking the first expression and differentiating partially with respect to y. So z will become dou z by dou y f derivative is f dash of 2x plus y plus g derivative is g dash of 3x minus y and we have minus y by chain rule we have minus 1 here. So let's keep this as a third expression. Now we are going to substitute from the second expression this value here. Let's write substituting 2 in 3. So third is dou z by dou y equal to first term f dash of 2x plus y is written as it is. Now in place of this we are going to write this and this is on the other side and this 3 comes as a division. So and there is a minus sign here. So let's take minus 1 by 3 bracket open dou z by dou x minus f dash of 2x plus y into 2. So we substituted the value of g dash of 3x minus y from here that is dou z by dou x minus f dash of 2x plus y into 2 whole divided by 3 along with there is a minus sign. Now we have to expand this that is dou z by dou y equal to f dash of 2x plus y minus 1 by 3 dou z by dou x and this becomes plus 2 by 3 f dash of 2x plus y. Now we have to group the like terms. So these two f dash of terms when we combine and this term we can take to the other side. So this is dou z by dou y plus 1 by 3 dou z by dou x equal to 1 plus 2 by 3 is after taking LCM 5 by 3 f dash of 2x plus y. Let's keep this as a fourth expression. Now we are going to take this fourth expression and differentiate this fourth expression partially with respect to x. So this becomes dou square z by dou x dou y plus 1 by 3 dou square z by dou x square equal to 5 by 3 f derivative is f dash of 2x plus y into 2. Let's keep this as a fifth expression. And again we take the fourth expression. We are going to differentiate this 4. Now partially differentiating with respect to y. So this expression becomes dou square z by dou y square plus 1 by 3 dou square z by dou y dou x and on the other side 5 by 3 stays as it is 
f dash becomes f double dash of 2x plus y then into 1. This is our sixth expression. We are going to divide. So we are going to divide fifth expression by sixth expression and by division this become this is actually s plus 1 by 3 r whole divided by this becomes t plus 1 by 3 s and while dividing this 5 by 3 f double dash gets cancelled and we left with only 2. 2 means 2 by 1. When we cross multiply this is s plus 1 by 3 r equal to 2t plus 2 by 3 s. Now let's keep the r term 1 by 3 r then we have to write the s term. So if I bring this to this side already this is s s minus 2 by 3 s. So 1 minus 2 by 3 is 1 by 3. So plus 1 by 3 s and this t term we bring it to the left hand side equal to 0. By taking LCM, LCM is 3. So this is r plus s minus 6 t equal to 0. Now this is r plus s minus 6 t equal to 0. This is our required partial differential equation after eliminating the arbitrary functions.